Subscribe to this channel for more videos and don't forget to hit the bell icon to become a part of our notification squad. Redmi Note 4, Redmi Note 5, Redmi Y2, and Mi Max 2. What do these phones have in common? It's the processor, the Snapdragon 625. Xiaomi has been using the same processor for all the budget phones since the launch of Redmi Note 4. This is the reason why. Xiaomi set the bar too high. This phone set an incredibly large precedent in price to performance ratio. The Redmi Note 4 set the bar too high for Xiaomi to beat their own previous efforts. Regular consumer by and large do not know the difference between a Snapdragon 625, 636 or the 845. They care whether the phone is fast in practice. Only the tech savvy notice the difference. Even though many fans are unpleased with Xiaomi releasing new phones with Snapdragon 625, sales number shows all the budget phones have sold more than millions of devices in India alone. So this existing strategy is working well for the company. The next best budget processor is the Snapdragon 636. That processor is made for a mid-range device that costs more than 14,000 rupees. Embedding the Snapdragon 636 on their budget phones, which already has less than 5% profit, will incur a loss for the company. With all that being said, I believe Xiaomi will have to continue to thread carefully with the next generation of phones. While it wouldn't be too difficult to top our performance expectations with the next generation, they would have to make sure the battery life continues to be in the ballpark of what the Snapdragon 625 yields today. Hit like if you found this video helpful and I'll catch you guys in the next one.